as I was broadcasting live on YouTube, had a question uh, come through the comments, quite a few comments too. And so far during the live broadcast, we have 124 likes, kind of nice. Uh, the question is from Molly or Molly 2000. He says or asks, what do you think needs to be improved in iOS 5? Uh, and you know, there are a lot of things that I happen to like in iOS, and there are a lot of things that I happen not to like in iOS. Personally, hang on. Okay, that had me worried. I was tapping in the wrong passcode, and I couldn't unlock it, and I think after the fifth passcode, I had it set to automatically erase. That would suck, um, especially since I wanted to show you uh, what I would rather have inside of uh, iOS 5. Um, Specifically, more granular controls over notifications. So Twitter, for example, I get notifications about just about everything, but I have to turn it off because I get so many notifications. I want a notification just for direct messages, nothing else. No mentions, no, no searches or anything. But I can't do that with the notification center. I would have to use a third-party app like Boxcar. If you've not heard of Boxcar before, that may help you for more fine-tune notifications with your social media, check it out. That is a, a free application. Another thing I would want to have, if, if not in iOS 5, then certainly in iOS. Let's make this a more general question. And feel free to throw in your comments here, and I'll read as they're scrolling by if you have other good suggestions for iOS 5. Better organization options. I'm tired of doing this. Like it's scrolling screen by screen. I want to be able to like scroll up and then stop. Uh, or you know, just different ways of organizing the screen, springboard. And I know you're saying, you should jailbreak it. I don't want to jailbreak it, okay? That's not the point of this video. You're asking me what I would improve. Uh, they should take a lesson from the jailbreaking community. A and I think Apple actually did hire someone from the jailbreaking community to help make iOS better. Uh, one thing, though, in, in relation to the organization, I would want to have the ability to press a button and have it uh, alphabetize the number of folders that I have. So uh, so I have a few of them, and they're all over the map. And, and it's, it's difficult to organize, because I've got like seven, look, okay, I've got like 700 apps installed on this thing. Like, it's insane. And I, I'm always installing new applications. So I would want better app organization options. They answered one of my big problems with uh, iCloud, and that is to be able to restore purchases easily, remotely, and to, to be able to purchase something and then to get to it at any point in time. That was one big leap forward in my estimation. But really, it comes for, for me, it does come down to some of those finer organization options. Another thing I would like to be able to do is use Siri to a voice dictate. Uh, well, I guess I could vo voice dictate. Evernote. But I wish that was quicker. See, it's it's thinking, it's thinking, and then it 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 actually t it keyed in if it focuses in there. Ever note two words, and it couldn't find it. So it should scan through my list of apps if I do something there, or instead of me having to jump through that hoop, I actually, you know, know that it's I meant Evernote because it was an app because I have it entered in that particular field, or you know, I'm entering the text into that particular field. Um, another thing that I would wish this had. Uh, I actually think that uh, Google's done something right with Ice Cream Sandwich in the way that they do Dictation Live. So you saw how I did Evernote. And I might say something like, okay, I'm recording a live YouTube video right now and it's going out over the web and a lot of people are watching it right now. And then what it'll do is it'll stick on waiting, waiting, waiting. Oh, that actually translated pretty quickly. Usually it takes longer than that. Uh, and then sometimes it doesn't translate at all. And then all the things that I just said are gone. Like those purple dots that are flashing, they just disappear and no text actually gets entered. I think that's a bug. So hopefully they can address that at some point. Um, you know, I, I think it's, uh, it's continuously improving, and that's one thing that I do appreciate. iOS 5 has always gotten better with time, uh, you know, like a, a fine cheese that is supposed to get better with time, or a fine wine, really, or even a bad wine. Well, no, actually a bad wine's bad early on or, or later on, it doesn't matter. Uh, being able to respond to messages on the lock screen, do you agree? Asks HRRK channel, Herc channel. Uh, yeah, actually, that would be kind of nice. And I think you can do that on a jailbroken device. But again, this isn't about jailbreaking, okay? It's about what Apple can deliver out of the box so that, you know, there would be at one point a possibility of Apple no longer needing to have a jailbreaking community if they could just address some of the shortcomings in a faster way. But, you know, they got to keep a lot of customers happy. And to keep them happy, I'd rather have a stable phone than a phone packed full of features, half of which I may never use, and half of which may crash my device. 
So uh, those are some improvements I would like to see in iOS. What about you? What would you like to see as a, a primary or a set of primary improvements for iOS? Leave a comment uh, and uh, I guess let us know.